In the small town of Dullesville, there was an annual competition that brought together the most eccentric and quirky individuals in the community. The event? The great Dullesville Duck Derby. Now, this wasn't your typical rubber duck race. Oh no, in Dullesville, they took things to a whole new level. The townsfolk would spend weeks preparing their ducks, decorating them in the most outlandish and ridiculous ways imaginable. One year, a man named Mr. Barrington decided he was going to win the duck derby with the most mundane and unexciting duck ever. He meticulously painted his rubber duck a dull shade of beige and attached a tiny briefcase to its back. To add to the excitement, he named his duck Quack Countant. On the day of the race, the entire town gathered by the riverbank, eagerly awaiting the release of the ducks. The atmosphere was buzzing with anticipation as the colorful and flamboyant ducks floated alongside Mr. Borrington's unassuming quack countant. As the signal was given, the ducks were set adrift and the race began. The crowd erupted in cheers as the vibrant ducks bobbed along the river, jostling for the lead. In the midst of the chaos, Quack Countant maintained a steady and unremarkable pace. To everyone's surprise, as the race progressed, Quack Countant started to gain ground. The townspeople couldn't believe their eyes as this plain, beige duck steadily moved ahead of the extravagant competition. Spectators were torn between laughter and disbelief. In a nail-biting finish, Quack Countant crossed the finish line first, winning the great Dullesville Duck Derby. The crowd erupted into uproarious laughter and applause. Mr. Borrington, with his deadpan expression, accepted the trophy for the most boring yet victorious duck. From that day forward, the great Dullesville Duck Derby became legendary, and Quack Countant became the symbol of the town's quirky sense of humor. The story of the most unexciting duck that took home the grand prize continues to be told at family gatherings and town events, bringing joy and laughter to the residents of Dullesville for generations to come.